Hey guys, so today I have the intro for my Mean Girls project pan based off the Mean Girls, obviously. And I have Mr. Bentley joining us. He saw the camera and thanks for taking pictures. So he needed to get in on it, guys. He's gonna be here. Do you say hi? No, he'll just smile at you the whole time. Anyways, this project runs from October 3rd to April 30th. So, let's just get right into it. There is 10 different, like, quotes from the Mean Girls, um, and each one corresponds to something. Anyways, so let's get into it. I have, for the first quote, on Wednesdays we wear pink, and that is um, something pink, obviously. So, I chose this, um this Milani lip liner in nude. I'm wearing it today underneath a Anastasia lip gloss. Um, but yeah, I have this much of it. I've had it for a while. Um, I don't want to say my goal is to use it up, but if I can use like half of it, that would be great because I don't really wear lip liner. Um, so even using like half of this is going to be a struggle for me. And then for the next one, I have, I'm not a regular mom, I'm a cool mom. And that's something that makes you feel cool. I have this Formula X um, nail polish and revved up Ignore My Nails. They look god awful. Um, I have about half of it. I marked it. If you can see that black line, I'm about halfway. So I figure I should be able to use that up. Um, I do usually wear fake nails and I paint my nails quite often so I'm hoping that I could use that up and then for um, the next quote it's I really want to lose three pounds and that's something that makes you feel skinny um, so I chose uh, my hula bronzer and this is just the regular one I don't have very much um, anything on it. I've had it for a while and I figure bronzer usually helps to make me feel a little bit slimmer. So I'm hoping that that works. Um, Alright. And then the next um, quote it was, full, is, it was full tilt jungle madness and that's something that shows off your wild side. So I chose this Arrivee freestyle working hairspray. Hairspray is something I don't really use a ton of anyways. Um, so I'm tr hoping that I can use this up. Sorry if my camera's shaking. My little one keeps like pushing my desk. So it's great right now. Anyways, let's move on to the next one. The next thing is I'm a mouse, duh. And that is something that is... Um, mouse colored or themed and for that I chose um, a shade from my naturally pretty eyeshadow palette um, and I chose the shade spice you can see I already have a um, I've hit pan and I have quite the dip going on in it a little bit of a sneak peek this is most likely gonna be my pan that palette next year so um, I didn't know that though until um, until I had already chosen these for this project. So I'm gonna say maybe not fully use it up, but definitely expand pan. So yeah. Anyways, I'm choosing the shade Spice. Um, so that is what I am going to use use it to like darken up my um, outer V and I also use it on my brows because I somehow managed to lose my brow powder. Um, so yeah. <laughs> and then I have whatever I'm getting cheese fries and that's um, a comfort um, item. So I chose my Mary Lou Manizer. I love, 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 love this highlighter. Um, as you can see, I've got a really good dip going on. You can see the rings. 
And my goal is just to hit pan on this, which I don't think will be very hard if I give it a lot of love, especially like right here in the middle. I'm, so, I've got to be so close, like a good two months of using this probably because I am trying to use up a smaller sample size highlight. Um, so hopefully, fingers crossed, that one should be fairly easy to hit pan on. Um, and then I have something that doesn't belong in your collection, and that is another eyeshadow from the Naturally Pretty um, eyeshadow palette, and that is this one in Miracle. Again, I was like putting shadows in here because I wanted to move this out of my collection. It's my oldest eyeshadow palette. So I've got this pretty good, um, pretty good size pan and dip going on and in Miracle. Hoping that that should be fairly easy um, to maybe use up by the end of this project. That would be a nice start to my um, possible pan net palette. And then I have something that's so fetch, and that is this um, CoverGirl Outlast Stay Luminous um, foundation. And I'm like down to here. This is my favorite foundation, so that is why I decided to put it in. Um, and like I said, I am down here, so it should not be that hard to use up. I am using a NARS one as well, but I think um, I think I should be able to use both of them up pretty pretty quickly. Um, and then I have Why Are You So Obsessed With Me? And that's a product that won't leave your collection no matter how much you use it. And that is this Mango Temptation um, Fragrance Mist from Victoria's Secret. I have this in another project, and you can see like my markings. That project is going to end this month. So a little bit of a sneak peek on this. Um, but I figure uh, I've had this forever, and I've used it a lot. I've used it like literally every single day since um, I put it in that project. And I'm like getting nowhere with it, so I'm just hoping that I can actually finally use that up. Um, and then I have, the last one is, I saw Patty Heron wearing army pants and flip flops, so I bought army pants and flip flops, you know. And that's something you bought because of someone else, and that is this Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. I've had this forever, and... I don't think I really bought it because of like one specific person, but I do know like back in the day people raved about this mascara. I know Kathleen Lights did um, and quite a few other people just like raved about how good this mascara was. So that is why I bought it. It was one of my like first high-end mascaras that I ever bought and I believe I like actually got this like on a really good deal where I got like this. Um, full size and then I got like their um, their mascara remover one full size for like the price of one or something so yeah I just really would like to use this up and I'm hoping that I can because I have used this quite a bit um, it's still going though and I do have some other uh, mascaras and projects but I'm really hoping that I can get this one moved out of my collection because I have a ton of mascaras that have not gotten any use because I just have the same ones open. So, yeah. Let me know if you guys are doing this project pan. I'd love to hear from you guys. Sorry if you could hear um, screaming and crying and whatever throughout the rest of this video. My son really just, like, wanted he just really wanted to share the love with you guys i hope you guys have a great day